They're all just right up the seam, and he's been able to get open. Pistol formation here as they tighten up things. Now just an option play to Hamilton, trying to get to the edge. Met with a ton of tacklers. Ball is out, and Westlake has it. Hamilton has fumbled, and the Chaparrales have recovered. A turnover mits a turnover, and Westlake gets the ball back after a Hamilton fumble. That is the sixth turnover of the season for Lake Travis. As Kirk Rogers continues to call plays here, they're going to switch up the formation here and split Jaden out left. They like the matchup there on third and 20. Skinner looking left, now darts up field. Doesn't have anybody in front of him. Still fires towards the end zone, and it's caught for a touchdown. A beautiful catch over the middle by Bryce Chambers. Touchdown, Westlake. Well, that play right there shows you something from Brett Skinner. Stepping up in the pocket, Lake Travis only with three men blitzing there. And watch this replay. Watch Brett Skinner, eyes downfield. Steps up in the pocket, keeps the eyes downfield, and stays patient, and then delivers a perfect ball into the end zone to Chambers. So Helms to Sockwell with Tommy Mangino in his third season as offensive coordinator calling the shots here. On third and six, here's the snap. Leon stands alone in the pocket, now flushed out. He's down. Big stop right there by Colton Vosick as he charged his way in. The senior captain all fired up, and that's a big momentum swing right there. As the ball is down at the 18-yard line, a loss of one on the play, and it sets up fourth and seven. Able to go deep tonight, up top. They kept everything right in front of the Westlake defense, and now Leone trying to leave the box, and that ball came out, and I think Westlake might have it. They do at the 11-yard line. Leone fumbles. Their first was Mays. He's the one that knocked the ball loose. Ball on the ground, and it's Westlake football. Well, you can say one thing is, you know, Westlake and their view of some of the calls here in the second half, it has brought the team, the sideline, the and the stands alive. It can really disrupt the offense's rhythm in a play. Second and seven at the eight. Kaiser to Skinner's left. Now Skinner looking left, has a man wide open. That ball is caught for a touchdown. Jaden Greathouse is into the end zone from eight yards out. Touchdown, Westland. Well, Jaden Greathouse somewhat silent in the first half. Just three catches for 27 yards. Certainly a guy you want to get involved, and they do it right there with a nice slant and a perfect throw from Skinner as Greathouse ties up this football game as Westlake will look to take the lead with the PAT. Back into a half pack. Looking to hand off straight up the gut. Hamilton not there, and he is corralled. Looks like it is right just inside the line to gain. And it is right at the 14-yard line, and this is close. It looks like Lake Travis is short. Yeah. We'll get an official ruling here in a moment, but this could be a big, big swing. As the ball is down, and it is Westlake ball. Yeah, I was, I was going to say, Joe, before that play, I, I would kick the field goal here. You're down one. You are given your helmet. That is a good sign. And we watched Dr. Brandon Smoot literally walk him up the walk him up to check the range of motion to his lower extremities, and TJ actually ran, actually broke into a little bit of a jaw. Self is in motion on third down and 10, where Lake Travis has been spectacular this evening, but not this time, as getting away momentarily was Leone, but Colton Vosick able to use that long arm and extend it out and trip Leone up. He was caught in the jet wash in the pocket. Jetted forward, had some space, but it was the right arm of Colton Vosick that tripped him up. Wide receivers each way. Now looking to hand off to Jack Kaiser. First down, yard to Moore, and he breaks three to the 20, to the 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Jack Kaiser. J.F.K. to the house. Touchdown, Chaparral. Boy, what a play there. Offensive line just blew open a hole for Jack Kaiser. He made, I think, broke one tackle at the point of attack, and then he was off to the races. That is the play that Westlake needs. You see the offensive line, Kyle Nattenstedt on a man down in the second level of the defense, and he really sparked that play for Jack Kaiser. Slot right, self going in motion. Now looking to hand off here, not much running room. And the ball came out briefly here, and it looks like Westlake might have it. And Wyatt Dollar has come out of the bottom of the pile, raising his arms in the air. And right now, the defense is pleading for a turnover. Whether or not it hit the ground, we don't know. Let's take a look. Marcion Williamson 
fumbles this football as he went to the ground and just basically gave it to Wyatt Dollar. He kind of lost it, and Dollar grabbed it with his arm. The senior captain just comes out of the bottom of the pile with the football. And now they really have an opportunity here. Skinner handing it off to Kaiser. Kaiser running left to the 15, to the 10. Busted outside the numbers, and he's out of bounds inside the five. First and goal, Westlake, as they try to double things up here in the fourth quarter. They already have a score and now a turnover. It's three forced turnovers, and all of them are fumbles. A fumble by Nico Hamilton, a fumble by Leone, and now a fumble on a strip by Wyatt Dollar, by Williamson, and it's first and goal Westlake at the four yard line. Kaiser to the right of Skinner, half back to the left. Looking to hand it off here to Jack Kaiser, and Kaiser is into the end zone. Touchdown, Westlake. Turnovers into points. By my count, John, that's 10 points off turnovers here for the Westlake Chaparrales, and they find Pater with JFK again as he is into the end zone for the score. Touchdown, Westlake. Boy, things certainly can change quickly in the game of football, and Westlake has really played a good second half, but they really taken this game over just in the last few plays. Second down and nine, two wide receivers to the right of the formation, one to the left. Skinner gonna pass Touchdown. out of the timeout. Going up top, Jaden Greathouse ice this game. Touchdown, Westlake. I don't know what Josiah Estes was looking at there. I don't know if he was caught looking in the backfield, but he was covering Jaden Greathouse when the ball was snapped, and then very quickly, Jaden Greathouse just ran right by him, wide open in the end zone, and man, probably one second into that play, it was clear gonna be a touchdown, and Westlake putting this game on ice, I think, with that score there. Wow. Coach, not always easy tonight, but to win a game like this, what does it tell you about your team? Well, we knew it wasn't going to be easy. We know that team's going to give us everything they got, and they did, and they gave us all we could handle. You know, finally made some plays in the second half, got, of our, got out of our own way. Uh, the penalties slowed down, obviously got a, a couple key turnovers. The kids found a way to win, and I just can't be more proud of these guys. They, they did what we asked them to do. They fought tooth and nail. I mean, they scratched and clawed. It's I'm so happy for those guys right now. Your defense, you mentioned a couple turnovers, the big fourth down stop. How big were they in the second half? Just find a way. You know, that's what we talk about every day. It doesn't matter. You bend, don't break. And, and we found ways. We got turnovers in the red zone we, on both sides. Either when we, had, we were backed up and we gave the ball to our offense there for a short field for that first touchdown to start the second half. So I uh, can't say enough. That's how you win games. You get turnovers, you give the offense the ball. Finally, got to ask you about your running back. You lean pretty heavily on Jack Kaiser. He delivered. What do you say about his game? This is a year anniversary from when he came out and had over 350 yards total offense. So I fully expected 33 to do the same thing. And we trust him. And uh, we gave, he gave us everything he got again. I mean, what, what a heck of a football player.